It is difficult for scientists to measure the height of clouds over large areas above a certain altitude. The environmental satellite Envisat provides measurements of the Earth's atmosphere, oceans, land, and ice. Envisat uses a multitude of measuring devices, including MERIS, the Medium Resolution Imaging Spectrometer. It scans the Earth by the push-broom method. Linear CCD arrays provide spatial sampling in the across-track direction, while the satellite's motion provides scanning in the along-track direction. MERIS has a primary mission to monitor the ocean's color, including chlorophyll concentrations, but it can also investigate links between the biosphere and the atmosphere, measuring water vapor, cloud top pressure, aerosol optical thickness, infrared sunlight, and cloud types. The satellite sends data as long columns of numbers that are used to calculate the height profiles of cloud tops. The scientists are able to pick out a cloud landscape on the satellite picture and obtain detailed information, including cloud altitude. A group of scientists are testing the reliability of the Envisat data. Their mission is to take a specially equipped Cessna to observe and measure the upper edges of clouds, comparing their findings to the data from Maris. The team must be airborne at exactly the same time and place as the satellite passes. The Cessna has various gauging instruments, including a LIDAR or cloud laser. Back in the laboratory, a comparison shows the results from both the Cessna and the satellite correspond perfectly. Measurements from the LIDAR are shown with a black line. The MERIS satellite data is reported in red and shows a near identical result. NASA sent the satellite CloudSat into orbit to help improve weather models. A few of its many tasks include providing statistics on the vertical structure of clouds, give vertically resolved estimates of how much water and ice are in Earth's clouds, and provide an indirect estimate of how clouds and aerosols contribute to atmospheric warming.